hi welcome you all to pebbles class 5 max in last class we have learned division in this class we are continue the same topic division again divide and check your answer the question is 59598 divided by 23 now we are going to do the division i told you this is a dividend and this is a quotient so you are going to divide this number with the help of 23 okay so first you have to see the first digit what is the number before you are going to divide or multiply first you have to write the place value ones tens hundreds thousands then Ten thousand. Okay, so fifty nine thousand five hundred and ninety nine ninety eight is divided by twenty three. The first we have to see the number five. What is the number five? Five compared with twenty three. So five is less than twenty three. So you can't you can't divide by this number. So next digit you have to go. So what is the next digit? Nine. So fifty nine is Greater than twenty three. Now you can divide it by fifty nine. Now you can divide fifty nine divided by twenty three. So how many times it goes? Fifty nine. So the divisor is twenty three. Twenty three into one twenty three. Twenty three into two you can get forty six. That is. Otherwise you can do like this. Three twos are six. Four twos are six. So forty six. So again, twenty three into three, you can do three threes are nine, two threes are six. But I told you, so you have to write the number less than this. So you are going to take only fifty nine. Sixty nine is uh, greater than fifty nine. So what is the number you have to choose? Forty six. So forty six is less than fifty nine. You have to subtract nine minus six. You can get three. So five minus four, you can get one. So the quotient you have to write. Don't forget write the quotient. Twenty three into two, that is forty six. So thirteen is lesser number than twenty three. So always it should be greater. So you have to bring down the next digit, that is five. Now this number is one hundred and thirty five is divided by twenty three because. This number, this dividend is greater than the twenty-three. Always dividend is greater than the divisor. So you again you have to write the formula. That is twenty-three three. It's, you can get sixty-nine. Can you write twenty-three by five? Twenty-three multiply by five. So five threes are fifty-one. Carry one. Two fives are ten. Ten plus one eleven. So what is the number? One hundred and fifty. Shall we go to the next table? Twenty-three multiplied by six. Six threes are eighteen. Carry one, and six twos are twelve. Twelve plus one thirteen. Okay, but you can't write one hundred and thirty-eight because this is one hundred and thirty is greater than one hundred and thirty-five. So you have to choose this number that is one hundred and fifteen. So you have to separate again. So five minus five, you can get zero. Three minus one, you can get uh, three minus one, you can get two. So one minus one, you can get zero. So no need to write it. So go to the next digit. That is what is the number? Next digit is nine. Nine. So what is the number you can get? Two zero nine. That is two hundred and nine. 
okay so again you have to do this what you are going to do it is 23 multiply by 8 8 3 is 24 carry 2 8 2 is 16 16 plus 2 18 so we'll go for some other number 23 into 9 Nine three is a twenty-seven seven. Remaining is, is go down goes to on the top, and nine two is a eighteen eighteen to twenty. But what is the number here? That is two hundred and nine. But what is the number you got it? Two hundred and seven. So two it two hundred and seven is less than two hundred and nine. So you can choose this number. So write the co question. So I already you have uh, you are already I forgot to write the question. That is. Um, five. You have to write it here. The next number is now twenty-three into nine. That is two hundred and seven. The remaining what is the number you get? Two. So nine minus seven, two. Again, you have to bring down the next digit. That is eight. Now it is twenty-eight, and the divisor is twenty-three. So anyhow, it's less than twenty-eight. So twenty-three into one, you can get twenty-three. So you write only one. One into twenty-three, twenty-three. You have to write twenty-three right here. Again, you have to subtract. What is the number? Eight minus three. You can get five. So this is the reminder, and this is the quotient. So you can get quotient is two, five, nine, nine, one. That is two thousand five hundred and ninety-one. Then the remainder is five. So I told you already. Whatever you have to get the quotient or the remainder, you have to do the check method always. Then only you can confidently say the quotient is right and the remainder is whatever you find out the quotient or remainder is correct. Okay. Check method. What is the formula? I taught. I taught you already. Quotient into Divisor within the bracket plus remainder is equal to dividend. Dividend is nothing but this is the question. Okay, quotient. What is the quotient? Two thousand five hundred and ninety-one into divisor. What is the divisor? That is divisor. So what is the divisor? Twenty-three. Then within the bracket. Plus, what is the remainder? Five. So, if you will multiply both numbers and you add with this five, finally you will get the quotient that is fifty-nine thousand five hundred and ninety-eight. Your answer is correct. Otherwise, it is wrong. So, I have to multiply two thousand. Shall I rub it? Two thousand five hundred and ninety-one ones, tens, hundreds, then thousands. Multiply by twenty-three. So one three is a three. Three nine is a twenty-seven. The carryover is go to this place. It is hundreds place. And uh, three five is a fifteen. Fifteen plus two seventeen seven. Carryover is this goes to the Uh, top of the thousands place, two threes are six. Six plus one seven. Again, I'll repeat. One threes are three. Three nines are twenty-seven. Seven carry over is go to the hundreds place. Three fives are fifteen. Fifteen plus two seventeen. Seven and the one is go to the thousands place. Three twos are six. Six plus one seven. The next, you must write before you're going to multiply by the next digit. You have to put zero in the ones place. So one twos are two, or two ones are two, and two nines are eighteen. Eighteen eight carry over is again one, and two fives are ten. Ten plus one eleven. Again carry over is one. Two twos are four. Four plus one five. Add both numbers. So three plus zero three. Seven plus two nine. Eight plus seven fifteen five, and again one. Seven plus one eight, eight plus one nine, then five. The answer is fifty nine thousand five hundred and ninety three. 
then you have to add with the remainder. Remainder is 5. So, 3 plus 5, 8, 9, 5, 9, 5. So, 59,598. That answer you, you will get it. So, whatever the quotient is right, whatever the answer, whatever the reminder is, correct. The quotient is 2,591. The reminder is 5. Both are correct because you will get the same dividend. That is the question. You got the question. So, this is the right method of the division. So, divide, you are divide the sum and check, you check the sum also.